there, welcome to the huddle. I'm Crystal Rich, joined by Matt Demecki. What's up, Crystal? Matt, it's been so I long since, since, since I've it. been here. She's she been at the Super Bowl, so she's been living Super it up. Bowl, still rocking my green. That's Look how much that. I'm still like on this Foles high. It's it's like huh. literally the best so time proud. my whole entire life. I'm so proud. How have you been? I've been good. I've been good. I've been here while I've been. Watching you at the Super Bowl. I'm right, jealous. Right, right, right. Yeah. I bought a Nick Foles Super Bowl jersey. Look at her. Two hats. Doing her two thing. Two scullies. The DVD. <laughs> I'm framing the ticket. It's just, it's been going crazy. Man. Okay, so we have a huddle discussion. Don't worry, it's not about the Eagles, but it does have to do with football. Johnny Menzel had an interview with Good Morning America and unveiled that he was diagnosed with bipolar disorder a year ago, and his goal is to come back to football. Does he deserve a second chance after everything he put the Browns through? No. <laughs> and, and and here's why. Because that was so cold. Because no. here's Johnny Manziel out here promoting his new line, the comeback season. He has the sweaters. He has everything like that. But to have a comeback season, you actually had to do something before you come back. He didn't do anything with the Cleveland Browns. Like this man has thrown seven touchdowns, seven interceptions with the Cleveland Browns. Man, you, I mean, man, are, you are know we, them stats. You know them stats. Are we going to declare a comeback season for this guy? I mean, dude threw 100 yards basically okay. in his first season. The next season he won two games. What are we getting excited about? But, Why does he deserve a second chance? But are you going to buy his clothing line? I probably will. See? Because how, those sweaters are pretty you, dope. I'm not going to lie. How can you support his clothing line but that says comeback, but you don't support him coming back? Because you have Speechless. to. To be a good quarterback in the NFL, <laughs> you can't be throwing seven touchdowns and seven picks before you have your comeback season. Okay. There's no comeback season okay, in Okay, so let me say this. This is why I do believe that he deserves a chance. He was the only person to get a Heisman Trophy in 2012 as a freshman. So on top of being bipolar and not knowing that he's bipolar, that's a lot of attention put on you freshman year of college. What were you doing freshman year of college? You were probably drinking when you weren't supposed but, to be drinking, right? You're doing all this crazy stuff. But do so, you think do you think if you let Johnny Manziel back into the league, he's basically going to put himself in that life he was in before. It's not going to go so. away. The girls I, are going to be there. The alcohol is going to be there. Everything's going to be around him. And the temptation is going to be worse. He had some. He had this quote who said, he said he was watching football and he just sees everyone else doing what he wants to do as he's sitting on the couch being a loser. And that is the worst feeling ever. So he said that he stopped drinking and he was drinking because he was self-medicating when he didn't know that he was bipolar. No, he, he's, he's not a loser for self-medicating or, or drinking alcohol. He felt alcohol. like a loser. Yeah, he, he felt, he like, felt a loser, like a loser. But it's because of his play, not because of <laughs> what he was doing. He I felt mean, like a loser because he was sitting on the couch while everyone was doing what he wants to do which is play football. So I feel like, yes, give him a chance. He's obviously not going to be a starter. Let's see how he is as like a third stringer, as a backup quarterback. I hey, don't even think he's backup, good enough for that. Backup quarterbacks, they're winning nowadays. Look at my green dress. This represents Nick Foles I mean, to the fullest. That, that's because Nick Foles can actually play. Johnny Manziel, I mean, in his whole entire Cleveland Browns career, like what has he done? I right. mean, I know he's the last quarterback to win a, a Browns game. But at game. the same time, he, he, you're right, he has not done hardly anything done at nothing. all. But at the same time, that was him drinking, that was him partying, that was him going crazy. But he was doing that in college and he was succeeding. Well, this, this is and, the pros, and, and, and this is the pros. pros. The, he, learned, he learned hard. He's learning his lesson now. And another thing is that who doesn't like a good comeback story? I mean, I mean, come on, I know I've been talking about the Eagles all day, but we were the <laughs> underdogs throughout the whole entire playoffs. Who doesn't like a good comeback story? I'm just saying that People had to have seen something before this happened. Like, I mean, if you have a QBR of nine in your first season, and if you have a QBR of 62 your next season, I'm not gonna get excited over Johnny Manziel coming back. I'll buy two sweaters though. Wait, I know, wait, I know they're. How can I'll you buy two sweaters though. How can you justify buying two of his comeback sweaters, but you don't support the comeback? I just like the brand. I just don't like Johnny Manziel as the quarterback. There's a reason. Like, people are comparing this to the Josh Gordon situation. That's way different. I mean, Josh Gordon was a pro bowler with Jason Campbell, Brian Hoyer throwing him the ball, and Brandon listen, Whedon. Sports, I mean, no matter come what on, the circumstance, this is different. No matter what the circumstance, sports, they're always about the comeback. I mean, look at Tom Brady, not this year because obviously he <laughs> lost, but in the last Super Bowl, 51, where he came back from 28 to 3 over the Falcons to win in overtime. It's That's what we love about sports, the comeback. Tom Brady can 
can throw deep balls and and uh, be a good quarterback. Johnny Manziel can't. I'm right, sorry. Well, stay home. Let us know if Keep you are Team though. K. Rich or Team Matt Demecki. He better not rock that sweater next time we're here. Let us know in the comments below, and don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. We'll catch you next time.